SunMed, uh, Garcia. It's been a long time coming. From Colta off Key Highway downtown to Curio's Far and Daughter grand opening in Timonia. One, two, three, Curio! It's very exciting. Cannabis has changed my life professionally, personally, um, and for my health. So I'm ready for everyone else to experience that. It's the end of prohibition. People are showing out for the first day of legal recreational marijuana sales in Maryland. We've added staff, we've added product, we've added security. We put in a secure pickup window. And it's like a fresh batch, I'll give you that. Relief Shop had a line wrapping around the corner. I think it's a historical event. Glad today that we could cut out the middleman and go straight in and get the access and help that we need. Many dispensaries converting Saturday from a solely medical cannabis shop to adult use too. That includes Verano Zen Leaf in Elkridge. A lot more people, a bigger flow, but it still moves really fast, so it's still easy to get in, get out. We're just eager to see this uptick continue, and hopefully, you know, that translates to more jobs, more opportunities, and even more increase to safe access. Marylanders behind these businesses say this is just the beginning, and they're ready to educate people on how marijuana is changing lives. Now, I think it's important that people that always saw the value in this plant but didn't have a medical card, didn't have a safe way to purchase it, and now they do. Even though it's now legal to buy, state law bans people from smoking in public. You can get in trouble for crossing state lines with marijuana too, and weed is still banned anywhere that's considered federal property. Live in the newsroom, I'm Tommy Clark, WBAL-TV 11 News.